Welcome to the video from DigitalLifestyle.com. New Windows 11 build to look at. This is build 22000.176 for Windows Insiders on the beta channel. The difference now is uh, this is on the beta channel and inside of the dev channel I've got a different build. So they're getting uh, devices on the dev channel are getting builds from the future development of Windows 11, probably the first update to Windows 11. Whereas this build is the version that's going to, or potentially the version that's going to ship on the on the 5th of October, maybe a few more updates before then. So there's a couple of things that's changed in this build as well. One thing to mention, uh, a few insiders have had it where the icons are not showing here on the taskbar. There's a workaround on the blog, um, the, on the Windows blog and on the digitallifestyle.com as well. So showing it if you get stuck, there's a way of fixing that problem. The Microsoft say they've solved it, it was a server side issue. So the changes with this one, there's actually only a few as you'd expect are so close to release. And taskbar settings now, you can toggle uh, which icon you want on, so you can have the chat. So if you decide you don't want the chat, and you you want to tidy up your taskbar and just have as mi sort of minimized uh, minimal set of icons on there, you can do that like that. But uh, I like these on there, so I'm going to leave those on. And I want the pen menu, and I can just you know you can you can turn these on and off the pen menu appears down here but yeah so those those are the main uh, those are a, a new feature to turn those on and off which makes sense you can sort of clean it all up the rest of the changes this big builder just fixes they fixed an issue with bluetooth uh, or bluetooth reliability issues especially with bluetooth le and uh, blue screens that kind of thing so that's been fixed they've fixed some issues with usb cameras um, windows hello and they fixed some issues with the store. There's still some known issues with this build. If you're um, upgrading and um, you don't, your taskbar doesn't work, there's a w workaround for that as well. And there's still some issues with Start and, uh, and minor issues with, with st the Start and the Sandbox. The store has been updated. This was rolled out to the dev channel a couple of weeks ago, but this is um, in the library's view of the store. And this is much easier to use now. You can see recently installed and updated apps on here. You can sort them, and it's a lot better than the than the old build build version. So that it looks a lot better, and it's a lot simpler to navigate. So I'm glad they they've done that as well. So that's it with this build. Windows 11 is shipping October 5th. If you've got a compatible device, this is a Surface Laptop 2 I'm running on, which is compatible, and that. Uh, and that would be offered the update. What Microsoft say, they're doing it from the 5th of October and that's going to run into next year. So, and there'll be ways to force it really if you, if you really, really want to. But uh, yeah, it's looking good, Windows 11. Um, I like using it and I uh, wouldn't, wouldn't really want to go back to Windows 10 now. So that's that's good. Uh, you can find out more on the digitallifestyle.com. You find me on Twitter at Dixon. Thanks for watching.